Unlock the secrets of one of the world's most dynamic cities with our insider guide. London brims with both iconic landmarks and hidden gems waiting to be discovered. From sipping an early pint at historic alehouse to exploring quiet, lush gardens amidst the city's hustle, every corner holds a unique experience. Dive into our curated list of the city's best spots and uncover what makes London truly unforgettable. Number 1. Visit St. Dunstan in the East Church Garden Discover a hidden gem in London at St. Dunstan in the East Church Garden. This serene spot, tucked among the ruins of a church built in the 1100s, was damaged in the Great Fire of London and World War II. Instead of being rebuilt, it was turned into a public garden. Now, the church ruins are covered in ivy and surrounded by lush trees, offering a peaceful retreat from the city's hustle and bustle. It's a perfect place to relax and enjoy some quiet time. Number 2. Get Thai food at the Churchill Arms Visit the Churchill Arms for a unique dining experience in London. This pub, known for its stunning flower-covered exterior, is also famous for its authentic Thai food. Start your visit with a pint and enjoy the eclectic decor filled with antiques and memorabilia. When you're ready for a meal, head to the back to enjoy classic Thai dishes like Pad Thai, Pad Si Yu, and Panang Curry. Don't miss out on a refreshing Thai iced tea to complete your meal. Number 3. Grab coffee at a cabman shelter. As you explore London, keep an eye out for little green huts called cabman shelters. Built in the late 1800s to provide food for black cab drivers, only 13 of these shelters remain today. While only licensed cab drivers can dine inside, you can still enjoy a coffee or sandwich from the takeaway window. Luba's Green Hut Cafe on Kensington High Street is a great spot to try. The friendly owner and delicious sandwiches and pastries make it a must visit. Number 4. Go to Little Venice. Explore Little Venice, a charming spot in London near Paddington Station that feels like a slice of Italy. Here, you'll find lovely canals with colorful houseboats and cozy cafes perfect for a relaxing afternoon walk. You can also take a canal cruise or enjoy a meal at one of the houseboat restaurants. For something a bit different, try stand-up paddleboarding on the calm waters, but be careful, if you fall in, the murky water isn't very inviting. Number 5. Enjoy the view from the Royal Opera House rooftop. Escape the hustle and bustle of Covent Garden by visiting the rooftop terrace at the Royal Opera House. You don't need a show ticket to enjoy this spot, it's open to the public all day. The terrace features a full restaurant and bar, but you can also bring up a snack from the cafe downstairs to enjoy the stunning views. With plenty of space, it's a great place to relax and take a break from the busy city. Number 6. Walk the Greenwich Foot Tunnel Discover the Greenwich Foot Tunnel, a hidden gem in London that crosses under the Thames River. This 1,200-foot walkway can be accessed via elevators from Greenwich or Millway and is used by over 4,000 people daily. While it might seem quieter than expected, it's a unique and interesting way to cross the river. Inside, you'll see the tunnel's distinctive domed white tiles, making for a memorable and off-the-beaten-path experience. Number 7. Enjoy an evening at a pub theatre. Experience world-class entertainment in a unique setting at a pub theatre in London. These small, intimate theatres, seating 40 to 60 people, are located above pubs and offer a great way to enjoy London's legendary theatre scene without breaking the bank. We'd recommend the Drayton Arms in Kensington or the Café Canal in Little Venice, but you'll find pop notch performances at any of these cozy venues. Number 8. Check out the The Postal Museum Visit the Postal Museum in London for a unique experience, especially if you love the mail rail. This underground ride takes you along a 0.62-mile track that was once used to deliver mail. It's now a fun ride with an informative audio and visual show. Note that the train was designed for mail, not people, so it can be a bit tight, which might not be great for those who are claustrophobic. Besides the ride, the museum has fascinating exhibits on the history of the Royal Mail and a huge indoor play area for kids with a mini town, slides and ball pits. Separate tickets needed. Number 9. Dine at the V&A Cafe Dine at the V&A Cafe, located inside the historic Victoria and Albert Museum. This was the first cafe ever opened in a museum, and it's stunning with its grand columns, colorful ceramic tiles, and stained glass windows. Enjoy delicious food or just grab a tea or coffee. Sometimes they feature live piano or harp music, 
making for a unique experience in a beautifully acoustic designed space. Check the museum's calendar online to see if there's live music during your visit. Number 10. Swim at Hampstead Heath Cool off from the summer heat at Hampstead Heath, a large park with three swimming ponds. There are separate ponds for men and women, open year-round with lifeguards, and a mixed-gender pond that's open seasonally. The park also offers walking and cycling trails, cricket pitches, tennis courts, and soccer fields. Don't miss a visit to the nearby Kenwood House, which is free to enter and was featured in the movie Notting Hill. Number 11. Visit the Columbia Road Flower Market Head to the Columbia Road Flower Market in Bethnal Green on Sundays from 8 a.m. to 3 p.m. for a lively and colorful street market experience. This bustling market is packed with beautiful flowers, plants, and cacti, making it a feast for the senses. Even if you can't take home a plant, the vibrant atmosphere is worth the visit. As you stroll through the market, you'll find charming boutique shops, art galleries, and cozy restaurants on Columbia Road. The area is full of unique finds and great spots to enjoy a meal or a coffee. Whether you're a plant lover or just looking for a fun outing, Columbia Road offers a delightful experience every Sunday. Number 12. Watch the sunset at Primrose Hill Head to Primrose Hill, just north of Regent's Park, for a stunning sunset view. This park features a 210-foot natural hill that offers a panoramic view of the entire city skyline. It's the highest point in North London and a perfect spot to watch the sunset. Before settling on the lawn, find Shakespeare's tree, a large oak planted in 1864 to celebrate the writer's 300th birthday. The tree you see now is a replacement planted in 1964. Number 13. Admire the Kyoto Garden in Holland Park. On a sunny day, visit Holland Park and explore the Japanese-style Kyoto Garden. This serene garden, a gift from the city of Kyoto to London in 1991, features a peaceful koi pond, tiered waterfalls, and traditional stone lanterns. You might even spot a few peacocks roaming the grounds. But Kyoto Garden isn't the only Japanese garden in Holland Park. The Fukushima Memorial Garden, opened in 2012, expresses gratitude for Britain's support during the Fukushima nuclear accident. Number 14. Go Lawn Bowling in Hyde Park You're likely familiar with cricket and polo, but have you ever come across lawn bowling? Similar to box ball, this game has a history in England spanning over 800 years. If you're interested in giving it a try, head to Hyde Park, where you can rent a rink in their outdoor bowling green. Up to six people can play at once, though it's still enjoyable with just two. The bowling green is open to the public from April to September. And don't worry if you're a beginner, you'll receive a scorecard along with instructions to help you learn the game's tips and tricks. Number 15. Shop till you drop at Leadenhall Market. London is a shopping paradise, famous for its high-end stores, boutiques, and markets. Leadenhall Market, near Sky Garden, is one of the most beautiful. Dating back to the 14th century, its Victorian architecture features intricate ironwork, decorative columns, and a stunning glass roof. The market offers clothing and accessory shops, a unique bookstore, and various restaurants, cafes, and pubs. Number 16. Spend the day at Battersea Park For a fun family day in London, visit the 200-acre Battersea Park. This Victorian park, located on the Thames, offers beautiful gardens, attractions, and activities. Highlights include the Battersea Park Children's Zoo, where kids can see monkeys, otters, donkeys, and reptiles. You can also rent paddle boats on the lake and use the outdoor sports facilities with tennis courts, running tracks, and soccer pitches. Don't miss the Pump House Gallery for the latest art exhibition. And that concludes our list for today. I hope you enjoyed the video, and if you did, please click on the subscribe button and like this video if you haven't already. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one.